Now, if you moved on, then move on. This is the second time a YouTuber did story time and it went left. The first YouTuber is popping up right here, but Aaliyah J got caught up because she did the story time and Rel and PNB Rock both spoke out. But to catch y'all up on the story, just in case y'all don't know what's going on, Rel was in a relationship with Aaliyah J. And according to Rel, he's saying that during the relationship, she was flying out to see PNB Rock. At that time, he didn't know it was PNB Rock. He just said it was a rapper. And PNB Rock told a similar story saying that when he was in the studio, with Aaliyah J she was arguing with her boyfriend on the phone and things were going left so their story sounds similar now Rel did speak out which was the boyfriend at the time and I guess PNB Rock was the side nigga Rel said what y'all waiting for for me to respond to something these IG story reviews are ridiculous even though Rel did respond PNB Rock did and I'm pretty sure a lot of people were sending him her video and he said he wasn't about to sit there for no 37 minutes and I, I pretty much did sit there 37 minutes my damn self because I pretty much knew majority of the story of what she was telling because this is not the first time she told it. Here's what somebody told PNB Rock to sum up the story just in case you didn't see the video. Aaliyah J says she brought some girl out there to have a threesome with y'all and she said that she went through your phone and some girl was texting your phone saying you flew Aaliyah J out there but you couldn't buy my baby a stroller. She said your was trash all right so basically to sum up the video that's what she said inside of the video so he said oh nah she definitely wasn't talking about me lol she was with her boyfriend when i hit so that's when Aaliyah j saw that message and she started going off now if you want to read the messages yourself make sure you follow the timestamp down below where you can stop pause and read yourself Aaliyah j said i definitely wasn't talking about you Ooh. I think you was talking about him because it's crazy how she told a story time with Rel and PNB Rock in the same story time. So that's what kind of gave it completely away. Like <laughs> if you would have talked about them separately, maybe people probably wouldn't have caught on, but it was obvious. But anyway, so stop playing with me. And secondly, I wasn't with no other when I was with you and you know that so I don't know why you always coming on here now PNB Rock said that that song that he made which was a hit I'm selfish was based off of her so in that song if you ever heard the lyrics is basically saying I want you all to myself basically what he's saying he didn't have a Leah J to himself um you know that so I don't know why you always coming on here trying to talk ish I was with you all the time in the studio on the phone with you in your bed with your kid okay in the bed with the kid all right this dude's still mad because i dumped him you always on live talking about me don't you have a baby on the way you just wrote that not too long ago like do you want to beef or do you want to be friends okay so she's offering to be his friend but i don't think he's gonna take that then neither is a girl if she said it wasn't you and you know it wasn't you why are you even responding hey yo man it's a lot of disrespectful tweets getting sent my way lol gotta state the facts sir just say you miss her and move on i'm happy with my girl lol she's here right now What's up with these dudes arguing with their ex while they present is sitting right there? If you're happy with your present, there's no reason why you should be arguing about your past. A fan said, how you gonna dress a lot when you ain't even seen the video? I'm sick with you, sis. He said, I'm too much of a real dude to watch a girl YouTube videos and I got enough common sense. This is not the first time she played with my name. When was the first time? I've never spoke on you and we all know that. You're too much of a real n but you come on here all the time talking about you hit. What real n does that you always you was irrelevant to me before and still are to this day that's why you always shading me you're mad and you already apologized to me for talking shit about me you said it was because you were salty so why are you still on here talking being b rock you know i wasn't talking about you so why are you even trying to start drama please go away already i haven't responded to you in years i ain't gonna argue with you slime lol just stop making up fake shit about me and we cool if you wasn't talking about me again my back i ain't even see the shit, but i hate when a mother lie on my name so i'm gonna address it every time i'm tired of not defending myself i'm tired of these y'all don't understand four years ago these was attacking me and i took the high road because i really got the tea i don't do the internet y'all never see me argue but i'm tired somebody said maybe if you watched the first before tweeting that ignorant tweet there wouldn't be an argument what the fuck i'm not watching that lol i look like people out here sore and ain't slow mother know how to put two and two together she ain't mentioned my name for a reason who the fuck she was talking about then lol tell me uh i used to be with this so much i would sleep in the studio while he worked so you're talking about i had a man where because i couldn't be in a whole relationship while i'm with you 24 7 y'all not gonna keep saying i cheated on a 
with this guy i'm tired of being quiet now for those of you who really believe i left someone for this nigga here it is i dated this guy way before the florida trip all those story times and exposing videos that was made about saying i cheated with him false i told y'all i didn't do those things now leave me alone now lee J boyfriend did jump in he said fuck that shit we ain't gonna let twitter fingers ruin our vacation in paradise baby girl y'all in paradise coronavirus no now lee J and her boyfriend live in la and i think he and b rock lives in la or if he doesn't he visit la but they pretty much go to the same function so i'm hoping that this situation get resolved before they meet up in person you feel me because right now we on quarantine but quarantine don't last forever honey let's not have this turn ugly leave comments down below let me know what you're thinking until next time peace